Rashi was the drummer that uh, Coltrane was very close to, John Coltrane, and he uh, has uh, uh, incredible talent, and a lot of musicians love playing with Rashi because he plays with a freeness in uh, uh, his rhythms that uh, leaves it open for uh, improvising. He's an uh, improviser. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, he's a very unique musician yeah, as far as um, his approach to the guitar, because you can hear the quality of that soul funk, and you can hear the quality of uh, contemporary uh, classics in his music. <laughs>
in New York, see, like I've been in, in New York at times, man, where it was very hard. I mean, really hard, like uh, sleeping on the roof, to sleeping here, no place to sleep, no food, no trying to make it plan, plan a place for just for meals, you know, and things. Different periods like that where it was very hard. After like we came to New York with our net. Fifty-nine, and we played for one and a half years, and the man made very good. The club owner, where he bought another club, from, but we were still getting the same pay. And um, and we was trying to better our condition as workers. It was a time when you had to have uh, police cards to play, and uh, if you had been in any trouble or anything, they could take your police card away. You know, and it was very hard times. And afterwards, it was even harder. And. Even, I mean, even then, I mean, you feel like New York has some kind of a conscious, a conscience. I mean, you're going to, I'm paying all these dudes. And can't, I mean, there's no place, there was no outlet. And if there was a place where that you would play, it would only last for a little while. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 